up, folks? Mr. Raven here, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. Yeah, we don't even need to say anything about Alphers or anything. It's the real game now. Whoa, what the frick? Let's see if we can not uh, get our way over to the trader without being killed by a zombie. Because I kind of want to um, maybe build a shelter over there or something. I don't know. Is that going to, is that going to be too much of a copy from last season not even sure how much they altered the uh, the uh, zombie AI how does uh, the walking pattern are and tracking patterns and stuff like that not even sure where I am um, but I feel like And that's a good thing about playing um, in Nevis game. You can actually orientate towards something. I feel like... Um, I feel like we have the uh, working stiff over here somewhere. And maybe have the... Um, oh shit, I forgot the name of the city. Or the little town. Okay, my brain can't wrap it. Damn it. I know it when I see it. Or if some of you says it in the comments. Um, not Paris, then is it? No. Oh, it's made. Don't be mad. Just trying to kill you. Let's see here. I like to swim. But there's something about you can drink the water directly. Yeah, you can. Oh, it's not not heavy about that. Drinking from water source complete. Ah, oh, kind of mission without our challenge, without known. <laughs> well, pretty pretty much everything we do for the first time is probably be a challenge. Could it match? And let's let's take this uh, stump out. See if it still has the the honey. Oh, okay, so besides um, besides having a dear friend die, um, I've been using the time to you know recuperate and you know do my morning and stuff. But we also started looking at buying an electrical vehicle, a car, uh, instead of our or um diesel vehicle um, let me just kill this guy before um, continuing Let's see here what oh steve steve good so we've actually been out and driving a lot of different vehicles here in denmark we have like i don't know 40 different um, brands of cars from Tesla's to Audi's to Audi, Audi's, Opel's, um, Mercedes, Volvo's, everything. So we actually started um, by making the lists. Actually, we started about talking about which type of car we wanted. Um, and by talking to a couple of friends and co-workers and stuff like that, we kind of talked about we wouldn't go under 500 kilometers on range because 500 kilometers range um, is in test conditions. And, you know, if you want to keep within the 20, 20 to 80% charged, not charge 100%, and you want to do that, 
Um, if you want to do that um, in the winters as well, and still have enough power directly for me to get to work and back, I have like a 150 kilometers um, almost every day. You know, a, a, a range of 300, 350. Uh, on the coldest day, it might actually be a little bit too short. Because if you if you don't want to go under 20% and you don't want to go over 80% charged, um, could actually end up not making 150 kilometers. If you're driving a little bit of a queue on the freeway, on, on the way and, and home or to work, um, you would actually maybe <laughs> end up not having enough power. So uh, we talked about 500 kilometers range and you just can't get a small car or normal car with that type of range. You kind of have to go up to uh, an SUV or something or, uh, you know, one of the crossovers uh, to get there. So we actually ended up on that um, normally we've been driving um, a station car um, station wagon uh, you know normal looking car just a little longer <laughs> uh, we kind of like that format but um, and they are starting to come as a full electrical vehicle um, but yeah it's um it's, I think, the longest range we saw on a uh, station car were like 400, maybe 420. So, yeah. And, you know, um, we're getting older. It's not getting easy to get, to get out of a car that's so low. So, we stuck on the uh, SUE. And then there was like 35 cars. So we kind of, you know, I made it, made a, made a, a bed, bed sheet, um, spreadsheet, not a bed sheet. That's something else. Um, in Excel, where I kind of took all the cars, put them in, put some stats in, so I could start comparing them. You know, loading speeds, um, capacity on the battery, um, weight, pulling ability. If you want to have a trailer on it. Um, uh, trunk um, space um, all kinds of data um, okay I feel like that trader is about the same place as the um, alpha 21 playthrough so if I'm building a house down there it's probably just gonna be a little too close to what I did last time. So we got to like 250 meters from here. So maybe we should just try and set up shop there. Could be a, a nice uh, beginner house to stay in. You don't have to, you know, this don't have to be our final place. Oh, can always find something else. Oh, I got some books here. Cigars. Boost your strength. Nah, I'm not sure that's, that's cigarettes. I'm not sure that's correctly. Increase your bartering so and make you look like a six year old Tyrannosaurus. Yeah. Because that's really old school. Yeah, our inventory is getting full, so maybe this is not too shabby. Got a got a bunny rabbit. Oh, that's a lot of drop on that arrow. Wow. Are you kidding me? I felt like that was a hit. Mm. Apparently not. 
Can I pick some of my arrows up again? Oh yeah, I can. At least two of them. Oh. A vacation cop. Yeah, I'm gonna be happy about that. That's that's a tank. He's gonna take like 200 arrows. Not even dead yet. Oh my god, he's just an arrow sponge. I think I've put 13 arrows in him now. 14. Fifteen. Fifteen arrows. Okay, I got nine back. I guess that's better than nothing. Oh yeah, I don't like that. Huh? Oh crap. Maybe I could have tried to tried to get headshots, but okay. This house here, um, Try and be stealthy about it. fine clean up here well I could maybe start killing the zombies first then we can clear up Zombie, zombie, or a dead guy? Okay, guess you're a dead guy. Okay. like I've built here before. Fast, furious fist. Oh, yeah. Okay. Go 
don't think there's any more downstairs. Let's go upstairs. Uh. Oh, I like the shirt. That's new. And it's a little bit jumpy, isn't it? This is a bedroom. Hmm. I haven't found any clothes yet. food. Or we could use this as a bedroom. gonna be perfect I feel like it's it's close enough to the trailer and uh, you know it has a good size oh need repairing uh let's wait with uh, cleaning up the place um, let's go downstairs oh, it's actually Really, really far way right down. Let's uh, close the door and reinforce it. Um, let's close that one and reinforce that. Or repair and reinforce. I kind of like that it doesn't change the door under it. Just put boards, boards up. That's new. Um, well, we can use the doors to kite them around. If 
you want to. Yeah. Okay, sweet. Um, let's see why. Yeah. Let's see here. Homestead. Mm, clan claim. That's what? One stone, five stones. Oh, okay, fair enough. Let's see here. I think I can put it maybe here. Oh, oh crap. up shop we're we missing one maybe mm, oh there maybe take that on out I think we can upgrade that to a normal block let's just change it out Upgrade it. Bam. Craft a wooden door. Um, shouldn't have repaired that. <laughs> Where I'm going to put a door now. Crap. It's not that strong. Uh, wooden door. A storage container. Okay. Can do that. Uh should we make this like a crafting area? Sure. It, it seems vaguely familiar. Have I done this before? I might have. Get out of my way. Uh, let's see here. the torch uh, place a spike trap and we could put like a spike trap like right there Just to piss off some zombies. <laughs> he 
so we can put our workbench there when we get to it. Um, put our campfire in, in the uh, thingamabob here. <gasps> it's night. Already? Oh, fantastic. Okay, so I upgraded a... Thought it would be a... Crap. Uh, what? Cobblestone, is that more? Hmm, I thought so. Let's close this up. Bam. Okay, so we completed that, I think. Yeah, let's collect it. Redeem, 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 redeem. Bum, 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 bum. Perfect. So I guess a better and this here now and then um I think I think I'm gonna try and clean up during the night. And um I'll see you back tomorrow. Or you know what I mean, in game. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please show your support by leaving a thumbs up. If you have any questions, advice, or just want to say something funny, please do so down in the comment section below. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. And the last thing I want to do is just wish you all a great day. Have fun gaming. Bye.